Is Christian music good or bad? Stay tuned if you want to find out. My name is Zeke Matthew, and welcome to Animated Christians, where we're animating just for you original movies, series, as well as clean anime and manga reviews. In today's video, we are discussing Christian music, and in the comments below, let me know some of your favorite Christian music artists or some of your favorite songs. Now I'm not saying all Christian music is like this, but I hope to give you a better understanding of what I see. I'm sure you have a lot of Christian artists or CDs somewhere in your house. And how often do we even listen to these types of Christian music? Not a lot, I bet. And I'm not talking about worship music here. If you want to find out more about worship music, you can click the video card above. First, let's say most if not all Christian music sounds the same, whether it be country, pop, rock, or contemporary pop. Most of them have familiar voices and most normally sing the same song over and over and over with a few tweaks here and there. A lot of the Christian music comes across boring, uninteresting, or even original. Sort of like the artist is being restricted on what they can do or they're not having fun with making their music. But if you look at a lot of secular music, you can see that they have fun with their music. For example, I saw Lego Movie 2. Spoiler alert. And I have a song that's stuck in my head from that movie. That song is no evil. It's so good and catchy that it makes you want to listen to it over and over again. Same can be found in the other musical numbers in the movie. The reason I bring this up is that most Christian music does not have the same effect. Why is this? It's like I said before, either the Christian artist is being restricted on what they can do or they're not enjoying the music they are creating. And if you're an artist listening or watching this video, let me know in the comments below if I am right or wrong about this. So, are there any fixes we can do to help address this problem? There are a couple of ways. One is when writing music, don't think about what's going to have the most impact or get the most attention. Focus on your story through your music. Second, you don't have to follow the crowd and do everything everyone else is doing. Be different and unique with your music. Third, have fun with your music. I don't want to see you doing the same thing as everyone else because if you have fun with the lyrics and music, then it will come across better. To give an example of two artists that seems to have a unique style, one of them is now disbanded, which is called Group One Crew. Their music falls in a more hip-hop style, and I read an article that they were a Christian version of Black Eyed Peas. But what made them so unique is that their music did not fit one style, and they had multiple styles like contemporary pop, R&B, pop, gospel and rap, but they never fit one style. And you don't have to fit one style either. You can have multiple styles in your music. Another one which falls in more of a rap gospel area is Rapid Fire Ministries, which has some excellent music by the way, but the lyrics are what hits home for me. There's one thing I want to say. Do not be afraid to have upbeat music in your album because for some odd reason, we seem to have this idea that all songs should be slow. There are times for slow songs, but I like to see songs with a little more energy in them. That and people having fun with their music. Use your creativity to be unique to the audience and don't just copy a secular song and make a Christian version of that song. That's not what you should do. Instead, study why that song became popular, why did people like it, and what made that song unique. 
then make a song unique to you and it doesn't have to be a carbon copy of that song. So I hope this helps anyone who may be in Christian music and looking to get into Christian music. Don't be afraid to try something new and join me next Friday where we will discuss creativity in the church. And never forget Animated Christians, it's just for you.